Yo, what's up? It's your boy Philip. Today I'm gonna show you how to bring up the um, side delt. This part of the delt. A lot of people, well, what I've seen in the gym is like um, they don't really focus much on the side delt. They only focus the front delts because you know that's what you see in front of your face every day. When you go to the mirror or anywhere, they will see you like the, the front delts the most. But you should focus more on um, side delts and rear delts because if you want those round shoulders like cannonball shoulders, you have to focus all three heads. So I'm gonna show you today the um, side, side delts, how to perform the exercise to bring up those muscles. For this muscle, usually we don't use it that much in our day daily life. So you don't need to go like stupid heavy to bring up the like your muscle like right here. Mostly we use it like front delts. We pick things up over our head, we always use this. So in, um, instead of the regular flies like rays side legs like this <clears throat> I'm gonna show you another way of doing it it goes like first stand up straight pull your shoulder back bend a little and have your arms like this hold the dumbbell like this and just face legs like that like that Now, the reason why I want you guys to try this movement is because you want to protect your shoulders from, um, you know, injury. Because once your shoulders is injured, you cannot bench press, you cannot squat. It's gonna give you a lot of pain there. Um, you know the rotator cuff. Check check it on Google. Um, it's hard to explain. Oh man, somebody calling. Well, that was my brother, by the way. <laughs> I'm not looking at anyone. <laughs> I'm looking at my brother. Um, so when your shoulder is all messed up, you cannot perform all those compound movements that much. So this way, when you like lean a little bit, bend your knee, and raise it, that's how you protect your rotator cuff from um, you know from the pain and stuff if you do it like this all the time like side raise like this it's gonna put a lot of pressure because your rotator cuff doesn't like doesn't design to move it like that it's not natural for it it's either this or yeah I guess that just it <laughs> um, your rotator cuff just want to move it front like that not side if you do this too much and you put a lot of weight, like you're using a lot of weight to do to perform this side raise, you're going to put a lot of pressure and a lot of um, like tension on the joints on your shoulders. So you does you don't want that. So try it this way. It's much safer, and you can also go heavy too when you get your form right and everything. Um, but it requires for you to like keep your balance and stable to perform the exercise and yeah I hope you find this video helpful and if you do like share and subscribe support your boy boy see ya on the next video <laughs>